So when they announced the spinoff to uh, Kaylee Cuoco's Harley Quinn, it's like, Kite Man? Really? I mean, he he got a little bit of a resurgence thanks to Tom King in the comics, and he was humorous in the Harley Quinn show, but it's like, really? Kite Man? But the show, <laughs> the show is so dumb, it's practically perfect. <laughs> uh, it's, you know, absolutely hysterical versions of DC villains, including Darkseid, who is voiced by the great Keith David, and it's... <laughs> It's, again, it's so dumb, it's practically perfect. I mean, just every portrayal of these villains, and we also see absolutely obscure ones like Six Pack. <laughs> That's a villain that I don't even remember the last time I've seen him in the comics. But, much like Harley Quinn, the show is stolen by a different character. This one being Bane. Bane just hams it up, steals the show in every scene. He is in, and he makes this show just worth watching. But again, though, in general, the show is hysterical. Like, I went into this thinking it was just going to be dumb. Just dumb. Not even a fun dumb. But no, this is not only fun dumb, it's hysterical dumb. Like, <laughs> it's, I recommend the show. It, it's just, that's how fun it is. I'm going to give Kite Man hell yeah. I'm going to get it an A. Did you enjoy the review? Make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to get notified when more reviews go live. Feel free to leave a comment to discuss your thoughts on the movie or show, and I will see you next time.